Philly D on the Skibby. Uh, on his Facebook Go Live um, post launch user interaction video. So I just want to get into what I thought of Facebook Go Live and what they've done. And I mean, yeah, it was very impressive in the beginning. Just to use it was a user friendly, anybody can get in there. You know, that had a cell phone, basically a good cell phone, and could have some interaction. Even with more than one person, you could flip the phone back and forth so that um, you can see yourself. If there's somebody in front of you, you can switch it back and forth, and the video would switch to them. So that's multi panning on the cameras. So that was pretty impressive. Um, Facebook obviously is going to do something else with this it's going to make it much bigger so we're going to have cams all over the place is what it's going to be live cams roll people doing crazy things stupid things it might cause more havoc sociably than it would be but the mind-blowing is you would never be able to dream this in the 70s so my hat's off to you and you can't see this in the video because I, this is more of a podcast podcast. But there you have it, folks. Um, I mean, I can go on a little bit more. Uh, what could be better at this product? Well, when you first go on, you hit the blue button. There's a big, giant red indicator that you are live. And it's got zeros across the board. So somebody didn't have that timer working. Now, I know that there's millions of people in the world that use Facebook or whatever. A lot of people use Facebook. But if you're going to be able to roll out something and go live with it yourself, um, you got to expect it to work for whoever you let that button go to. So if kinks weren't worked out yet with that little button, it's not like, oh, who cares? Let it go. Yeah, no, you have to let people know that that ticker's running so they know they're going live. Because who, if you think you're going live or not going live, wouldn't that be an invasion of privacy if, to put, if it's supposed to work? And they're probably laughing in the background if they're from Facebook because we've probably already signed all our rights off to Facebook by doing this to begin with. So that's how far in deep Facebook's got you. They... Later down the line, they'd be able to charge you money. And uh, you'd have to pay them to use their services, and you'd need them. The dependency has been way too sociably unacceptable. And the features um, of this particular go-live application um, still has to have some kinks worked out. Um, not sure quite about the audio. Well, it's... Is it going to be high-grade audio? If we put, uh, put a big old condenser mic up and, and plug in, are we going to get that hi-fi sound? That's what I want to know, Mark Zuckerberg. Uh, but good job, nice, nice job on the rollout. I mean, to be able to be excited about it because the, the big thing about Go Live and Facebook is that Go Live for Facebook themselves, they have so many users. So they're just not a proprietary um, name. Like say Livestream or Ustream or Switch TV or Justin TV, uh, gamers platforms for, for gaming on a live stream at the same time. And they would save it on their hard drives, but they wouldn't be available continuously on some kind of a um, thing if you would like that option so but we want to know what you think about this Facebook are you even going to use it would you use it because me I'll try anything once and now if I was in the studio with this I'd be able to to go ahead and put some people in there and make it a little exciting some clapping, some kick the football around a little bit. But 
on, a, on an overall scale, I give it a three on the rollout. I would not give it a five star. I would not give it a four star. If everything was working correct, the timer up top was not working unless it was played back. It worked after playback. Um, did not know how spotty it was because I didn't see it live. But um, I will get that information. It's either I didn't hear you, but you were blotchy on the on the video. So there you have Facebook Live post rollout.